A missing Medford man with Alzheimer's is now home with his family. George Waters had been missing for more than 24 hours. News 10's Dave Dayrarange spoke to the last person who saw him in Medford before Waters was found in Wairika. On Sunday morning, 81-year-old George Waters was reported missing from his Medford home. His wife says he hasn't driven in a year and has become lost in the past. Waters didn't have his medication. His wife says he took their family's navy blue Buick LeSabre with a full tank of gas. A couple hours later, Zachary Smith says he saw Waters at his car lot, confused and asking for directions. He said he wanted to get on the highway and go east to Medford and I let him know that the highway only goes north and south. Um, then he jumped in his car and he did about three laps around the tent and then uh, he went out this highway or out this driveway right here and went north on 99. After that, Smith got a missing persons alert on his phone matching the description of the man and the car that drove away. Jackson County Search and Rescue assisted Medford Police in the search. Unfortunately what we've seen in the past is when individuals with this type of dementia do this they ultimately become stuck or lost somewhere and it's just going to be a matter of time if we could get to them or find them before they are you know exposed to the elements. Then Sunday afternoon, Lieutenant Boudreaux says a second possible sighting reported waters in the Applegate Dam area. Night came and at about 11 Monday morning, a Wairika police officer found waters safe and ready to return home. Covering your news, Dave DeRange, News 10. Waters was found today at noon on State Route 89, about 30 miles east of Mount Shasta City. Police say he was disoriented, but in good health.